good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Welcome to Justina Organist channel. You are all welcome, you are all welcome. I want to give five reasons why I send my daughter to study in Ghana. I try to send her to school in Nigeria. She passed the jam very well and everything is okay, but they gave her a subject that she doesn't want to study because she wants to study medical field. So she waited the next year again. She wrote the jam. It's okay. They offer her a subject she doesn't like at all. And this became a problem. If you don't study what they give you, you forfeit that year. So we have wasted two years waiting for her to get her choice of subject what she want to study she couldn't get it for two years that was gone so i was so worried and now the sister is studying what she didn't even like to study and her own case she said never she will not she that her dream is what she wants to achieve by the grace of god so here we are, I send her to Ghana. Since I have friends in Ghana and I make some inquiries and even I choose three different countries. I make inquiry in, from Kenya, I make inquiry from Togo, I make inquiry from Ghana. And do you know, I love the system of education in Ghana. When I make all the inquiries. Five good reasons I find out that make me to send her in Ghana. Once you pass the WIAC from Nigeria very well, it qualifies you to go to the university in Ghana. From your country, your WIAC exam qualifies you because it's the same West Africa. That is number one. Because it's the same West Africa, when you pass your WIAC, you can also use it to go to the university in Ghana or to study whatever you want to study. In Nigeria, you see the last badge have not gained admission. Another badge will join them. That year, they have not gained admission. The third year, we join them. The fourth year, we join them. They will take only few and they have thousands of people, the millions of people all across the whole Nigeria. But they will make it so frustrating for everyone. So the second reason, Ghana and Nigeria, they are very close. And we are just brothers and sisters. I just love the Ghana people I have related with, Ghana friends I have. We are like sisters. I so love them. So I just choose Ghana because we are close to Nigeria and we are brothers and sisters. For me, that is my own reason. I'm giving you my personal reason. We are like brothers and sisters. We are close to each other, and we use the same West African results. Number three reason, the educational system, like I said earlier, is very good. They have very standard and good educational system, and I so like their educational system. Then number four, the country is very peaceful. All those uh, strike and strike and strike is not there. Their education system, the students are relaxed. The country is peaceful. That is number four reason. I pray that peace should reign in every other African countries in Jesus' name. It's not by power is just the grace of god number five reason i have is their admission system is very easy in my country where i come from admission system is not easy a student will pass WIAC. after you pass WIAC, the university of your choice will still set an exam for every student again to go in you will still pass that one whether it's post UNN or how do they call it, they will still pass that post UNN exam. They will still pass that one before they go to the university. All that, they will screen the students, screen the students, 
cut off, cut off, cut off, and at the end of the day, they will take only very few students, very few number of students. Everybody will wait again till the next year. The people that finish that year will now join the people that they carry forward from the previous years. You see the crowd. Everything is just stressful. In Ghana, they don't have those stress. Students are not struggling, suffering. Ghana, you just finish your studies as far as you pass your WAEC. Finish. You apply for the school you, of your choice and the subjects of your choice. What you want to study, you apply for it and they will take you easily after passing just their interview. It is so nice and peaceful. Though the foreign students, you have to pay more than that are citizens. Those that are citizens, their school fees are different. The foreign students, their school fees are different because you have to pay the school fees as a foreigner and you still have to pay for accommodation where the person will stay and the feeding and the medical aspect of it. Maybe I will make that in another video. All the requirements, I will make it in another video. I was so happy when she gained admission there and the whole process was easy. In fact, Ghana education is the best. If you want your child to get a good education, all road leads to Ghana. God bless you all. In my next video, I will still give you more about how it is in Ghana when the child is in school. As a parent, what and what you have to do to support that child or what you need to get for that child to be comfortable there. You will get it in my next video. God bless you all. Please just do me a favor to press push the subscribe button. Thank you all. See you again in my next video. Bye.